people hello everyone and welcome to my channel again i'm so happy to see you here and thank you so much for all the eight subscribers that i've gotten today i want to make a short video just talking about how you get to know yourself more and your wardrobe more and your style more and how you become less wasteful i really think becoming less wasteful is about not watching whole videos all the time where people buy lots of clothing. It's about watching more intentional content to get inspired to shop your own water and to really get to know your wardrobe. I think it's really important that you really look through your wardrobe and you're honest with yourself about what things you actually like wearing what things actually feel good on you and what things you just think look really pretty but you are actually don't feel comfortable in and you're never gonna use. I think it's really important that we try the clothing on we have in our wardrobe because when we try it on we can easily see if it's too small, if it fits us and if we feel comfortable in it because personally I think it's really important to feel comfortable in your clothing because if you don't the uncomfortableness will take a lot of your intention away and don't think that's what clothing is supposed to do. It's supposed to keep you warm. So it's really important that you know what you have in your wardrobe is something that you actually feel really comfortable in. And I also think this can help you to get to know what you like and what you don't like and get an idea of what different kind of styles you like. I don't think a person only have one style they like when it comes to clothing. I think most of us have a mix of different styles. So I think getting to know yourself and getting to know what you like is the first step to building an intentional wardrobe. Just going through, through what you want to keep and what you don't. And I'm not coming from a minimalistic mindset when I'm saying that because I don't think you should just get rid of things to only have a little amount of things. I think you should actually just keep what you like and what you feel comfortable in and what you use. Alright to have some extras of things. It's alright to have more blouses than you get through a week. Because if you have more than you need, you don't need to go out to buy any more when one blouse for example gets a hole you don't have to replace it because you already have another one and personally i think it's really wasteful if you get rid of it if you can actually use it and you actually like it if something else gets ruined and you can't fix it i think it's really important if some of your clothing gets ruined you know, that you try to fix it on it's easy just to hand so a little hole in a t-shirt or whatever <laughs> piece of clothing you have gotten a hole in. So I would say keep the clothing, all the clothing you like and maybe have a box or something somewhere where you have the storage for like extra clothing that you can use when another piece of clothing that you're already using has been ruined in some way. Then you don't have to go out and spend money on buying the new piece of clothing because you already have it in your wardrobe. So I only think the things that you should get rid of in some way is the clothing that doesn't suit you, that you don't feel comfortable in and keep everything else because I think that's less wasteful and I really think we should think about the way we get rid of the clothing that we don't use anymore. I think it's really important that we get rid of it in a good way. Maybe you can, somebody can reuse the textiles of the clothing or, and by that I don't mean that you should donate your clothing to H&M or something because it was like H&M are greenwashing you and making you think that they recycle all the clothing that you give them when most of the clothing that you give them aren't recycled. They're trying to do this to make them look more environmentally friendly so more people will buy clothing at the stores even though they aren't really all that environmentally friendly. I'm saying 
if there's actually a place locally or a person that actually do reuse uh, your clothing for new textiles, you give it away to them or you give it away to family members that might want the clothing. You can donate to a thrift store. If the thrift stores near you aren't already overfilled with clothing, if they actually need more clothing, you do that. Or you could sell it. So there's a lot of different things we can do that is responsible to do when you get rid of your clothing. I just really think it's important that we think about this and we don't get too wasteful because just throwing something out that you actually would use is something else, you know, got ruined and just throwing that away, that's really wasteful. So I really think we should think about not getting rid of a lot of stuff so we have less. I think we should also keep some of it. Anyways, this was just me rambling. <laughs> um, so I hope you got something out of the video, even though it's just me rambling off the top of my head. And I hope I'll see you soon and thank you for all the people who have subscribed to my channel. Please comment, like and subscribe if you like my content. And thank you for watching this video.